what's up it's Jessica welcome back to my channel if you aren't subscribed please do so right here so you don't miss out on any more videos feeling extra like girly today with the headband and the hair and the little accessories but today's video you guys is a makeup haul and your girl has been doing some makeup shopping lately I have been obsessed with makeup and trying different things and stuff so I figured I'd come on camera and show y'all what I've been getting myself into at Sephora and Mac other places okay so I think I'm gonna start with ColourPop and I have a ColourPop obsession y'all I be up on their site all the time buying stuff I know I don't need but just because I love ColourPop I just, I'm just buying it you know what I'm saying it's a problem I'm trying to work on right now I have recently did some shopping on there and um, initially I went on there to buy the Jen M I think that's her name she collabed with ColourPop and I, and I love her YouTube channel so I figured let me see what you know she did with ColourPop and I had to get it I just had to buy it so this is my ColourPop box um, and isn't this really cute the little floral detail I just love packaging let me show y'all what I bought so I bought a couple of lipsticks and I also bought some eyeshadows so I got this quad and it has four shades in there it comes like this okay so next I went to Sephora and did a little bit of damage. I lost my mind in Sephora, but... But anyways, I'm gonna share with you guys what I got. So, I was watching my girl, Maria Antoinette. Shout out to you, girl, because if it wasn't for you, I would have never thought about this. So I got this after watching her video. This is the Power Couple Kit by Sunday Riley. I am a skin care addict slash junkie. So when she was talking about how it made her skin look more youthful, it um, has made it look more refreshed and all that stuff. I said, yeah, mm -hmm, yeah, I'm going tomorrow to buy it. And that's exactly what I did. And what even sold me on it more, I didn't know the name of it when I went to Sephora. And the Sephora employee, I was trying to explain it to her. And she was like, I think I know what you're talking about. So she pointed to this and I said, yeah, that's it. She was like, girl, you need that. And she told me about how it transformed her skin. And I said, yeah, let me get that. Because everybody talking about this is the truth. I need it. So this is the Sunday Riley sunday riley power couple kit it comes with the total i guess they call this the total transformation kit there's this good jeans which is an all-in-one lactic acid treatment good jeans yes and they have this luna sleeping night oil now i'm gonna do a nighttime routine video showing you guys my skincare because y'all have been asking me about my skin and all that stuff but i am a firm believer of nighttime facial products because I feel like the body is trying to renew itself at night so you want to find something that's actually going to work with that process so I love anything that specifically says it's going to do something good for your skin at night okay so the next skincare product that I signed is a buy okay you know how you're in the line at Sephora and they have like by the cash wrap they have the last minute goods right that's that place right there, that is the most temptationist place. Temptationist, yes, I said temptationist. That place will tempt you into adding more to what you said you were not gonna spend. So I'm just in there minding my business, and then I see this, and I'm like, oh, it's facial product. And y'all know how I feel about facial stuff. So I was like, okay, well, let me get it. It was only $25. This is the Peter Thomas Roth. I guess this is like his mat. These are his, some of his masks, and they come in this trio. So it comes with the Irish Mud, the Irish Moor Mud, um, I can't tell, girl. The Irish Moor Mud Purifying Black Mask, okay? It also comes with the 24 karat gold mask and then also the Cucumber Gel Mask. I was like, I am I live for masks, guys. Like, I live for the mask. The fact that I get to try all three of these, I was like, yeah, girl, get it. Why not? It's only $25. They're this small. And I think that's a good, that's a good steal. You know what I'm saying? I've been using all three of these. And can I tell y'all something? They are absolutely amazing, okay? This was so bomb that I had to go back to Sephora. Yes, I had to take my butt back to Sephora and get this right here. This is also like a trial kind of thing, but it's, it's larger. So this one was $75. And this one comes with... The 24 karat gold one, it also comes with the Irish mud mask one and the cucumber one, but it also comes with this one, it's the rose stem cell, and this one says that it um, is a bio repair gel mask. I gotta try that. 
And then also it comes with this pumpkin enzyme mask. Pumpkin, y'all. I love pumpkin. So yeah, I had to go back and get it. You know what I'm saying? I love a good mask. It's so relaxing. It, I just love a good mask. So had to get that. Also from Sephora, I decided to get the Becca, um, I have it upside down, the Becca Ever Matte Primer. I love a good matte primer. So I did pick this up. Also from Becca, I had to get this. Now I am late to the party. This is the Becca Jaclyn Hill Champagne Pop. I don't know why I missed that bus, but this right here is absolutely the one of the most prettiest uh, highlights I've ever tried in my life. I'm wearing it today and it gives you the absolute most beautiful glow ever. Also from Becca, because Becca is just doing a dang thing, I had to pick up this blush right here. If you follow me on Snapchat, you have seen me raving about this blush. This is Blushed Copper. If you are a woman with brown skin, this needs to be in your makeup collection. I'm just letting you know that right now. This needs to be in your makeup collection. Do not allow this not to be in your makeup collection. It is absolutely the most beautifulest blush ever. Right now, this is my go-to number one favorite blush of all times. It used to be Raisin by MAC, not anymore. It's this one. It's this gorgeous copper, it's called blushed copper, but it's this copper color and it's like this deep rose and she's wearing it right now. And as you can see, it's adding life to her face. It's adding a glow and color to her face. That's thanks to this right here. You need this in your life, okay? This was like 30 something dollars. It's expensive, I know, but girl, when I tell you the, the payoff, the payoff though. Also from Sephora, I picked up this powder right here. I was asking one of the sales members um, what's a good uh, face powder and she mentioned this one and she said this is this is a really good one for kind of just like giving you that finishing touch but not adding too much foundation because you know some of the finishing powders add a lot of coverage to your face so it kind of makes your makeup look cakey. She said this gives coverage but it's sheer so it's going to look more skin like like airbrushed skin. So I was like, okay, let me try that. So she tried it on me and she used this brush right here because initially I was kind of skeptical as to if I wanted to buy it because it's a baked powder and I had issues in the past with baked powders, not, I wasn't getting any payoff. Like it was hard to actually get the product off of, you know, get some of the products. So she used this synthetic brush right here and it literally picks this product up with no problem. This is absolutely a really beautiful, a beautiful um, face powder. Like if you're looking for an everyday finishing powder, I think you might want to try this Sephora one. This is their micro smooth one. It adds just, a, it has like hints of shimmer, but it's not shimmery. It just gives you that light, I guess, you know, that reflection, that light reflection. And it's gorgeous. So I've been loving this lately. I had to pick up this brush. This is their, their Pro Precision Powder Brush. And this brush is amazing for applying the powder. So next I picked up a Beauty Blender. I needed another one so I figured I'd buy two so I have one handy at all times. They're just great to have. They blend out your makeup beautifully. So I had to pick up another one. Lastly from Sephora, I picked up this Bobbi Brown Contour Stick. It's a, actually, it's a skin foundation stick but I use this for contouring first of all I love the fact that it's a stick it'll make contouring and applying it easier to apply um, I picked it up in this shade it's called chestnuts and it's gorgeous so this is like the perfect contour shade for me it's warm and for me I like warmer shades when I contour I don't really like the ashy uh, dark brown shades because I feel like it makes me look like I have five o'clock shadow and we ain't got time for that I'm not trying to look like him I'm trying to look like her you feel me so I don't want to look like I have a five o'clock shadow going across my face not cute so I stick with warmer shades I use this once and I love it okay more makeup that I bought I told y'all went a little crazy okay I was not playing games so I picked up this from MAC I only got one thing from MAC and I just had to get another one of these Pro Long Wear Concealers because my daughter decided to drop mine on the ground and it splattered everywhere, you know what I'm saying? So I had to go back and buy another one, but this is worth it. I love this. It lasts all day long. You have to blend it quick though, girl, because it does not move once it's there, it's there, okay? So I got the shade NC45 and I love this one. So I went to NYX. We have a NYX store near my house and I absolutely love it. You guys can get your entire 
life in that store. Oh my God, is it dangerous? Yes, because everything of NYX is in the store. So I picked up this brush right here. I obviously have been using it and I love it. I use this to like do my contours um, when I'm using like my powder contour and just kind of like blended it out and stuff like that. It's soft and it's really good at just kind of like blending and airbrushing whatever you're doing out. So I love this. I picked up another brush. This is like a, I don't know what you call this brush, a fiber brush. I don't know what you call it. But um, anyways, I've got this as a highlighter brush and I use this to apply my highlight and I love the way it picks up the product and just gently like when I go in a circular motion and just do that and it highlights just flaky you know what I'm saying so I love this these brushes are super inexpensive and I love how they work they really do work I also picked up this what is this this is the on the spot makeup brush spray cleaner you know when you're doing your makeup especially those looks where you're applying a ton of um, eyeshadows and you don't want to mix too many eyeshadows on one brush because then it won't stand out on your eyes it'll kind of be mixed and muddy and all that stuff so I got this to clean my brushes as I'm doing my makeup so that I can kind of keep each eyeshadow look separate and not kind of like you know what I mean then I had to pick up my favorite eyebrow pencil I love this and I don't know why but lately y'all have been loving my eyebrows I don't know why I struggle with my eyebrows but this helps out a lot and it's super inexpensive this is definitely a dupe for the Anastasia Beverly Hills a brow pencil and it's really cool so if you haven't tried this one you're looking for a brow pencil you need to try this it's not as creamy it's gonna give you that very like that formula it'll put you in the mind of the formula of the Anastasia one which is very kind of dry which I like dry way better than creamy because creamy tends to look too um, fake and it doesn't look as you know it doesn't look as natural as the dry formula so I love this one so from Ulta I went and got this L'Oreal Infallible. Absolutely love it. I actually have a makeup tutorial that should be up soon or it's probably already up. Using this one right here and I love it and I'm actually wearing it today. Oh my god, can we talk about the coverage? Yeah, y'all need to get this. The shade that I have it in is Classic Tan 109 and it is gorgeous. Lastly for this makeup haul, I have gotten on the Kylie Jenner bandwagon well not really but her lipsticks I had to get I had to get these now the first launch I think it was the matte ones I wasn't too much feeling like I needed to stay up late and fight with people to buy them I just wasn't feeling that type of way but when I seen these bad boys the metallic ones oh yeah I need to fight somebody for this one I, I love metallics and just the fact that I can wear them on my lips I had to get my life and buy them right I wanted them but I think they were sold out because I kept going to the site and they were sold out I'm like I ain't got time for this man when y'all gonna restock I literally stocked the Kylie website um, and her page to know when the restock was gonna be and I got them boo and I'm so excited that I got them I have three I have this shade which is this is rain right and it's just gorgeous it'll put you in the mind this is like the liquid lipstick of blushed copper so it's basically blushed copper's best friend you know what I'm saying blush and lipstick and this is so beautiful I love it so much like if Kylie Jenner didn't do anything else right she did these okay she did these right my next one which is my absolute favorite one this baby right here her name is King K when I tell you your lips are gonna be the ocean that breathe that that brings life this right here is absolutely beautiful and I'm wearing her today boom it's just beautiful like it's gorgeous I love this shade it's the perfect metallic perfect lip highlight it's just it's y'all gotta try it I'm telling you it's beautiful like it's beautiful I'm gonna need color pop to come out with some metallic lipsticks I'm just saying just color pop if you're watching and lastly I picked up air and actually I seen this a picture of Kylie Jenner wearing this and I thought it looked so pretty on her and I was like okay I have to buy that clearly our skin tones are different but I would love to wear this as like a highlight on my lips and I actually have it on right now let me probably a little more so y'all can see it's like a perfect highlight for your lips you guys this was my first haul in a very long time and I was so excited to just show y'all what I've been buying 
because your girl been shopping a lot lately like she's been doing the most but I had to share with you guys some of the things that I got and I hope you found some things or saw some things that you might just want to try go ahead and give it a try I'll try to link everything down below if I can if not then I'll just like write I'll just type it down there so you guys can kind of go look and see if you enjoyed this video please give me a huge thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe be sure to share this video with your fellow girl who loves beauty and makeup and things like that and i will see you guys in my next video Bye.